So the princess thinks she can come and make a mess on our bed. Like she's the boss or something. And use our laptop to do whatever she wants. Look at this mess. Who thinks that she has the right to do this? I don't. Good morning, everyone. So, Peter and I are going to be heading out to training in about five, three, one minute. We should be leaving right now. And then we're going to have, we're, gonna, we're packed with appointments tonight. Peter has a ton of appointments today and tonight. So we're going to be really busy today. I'm going to be busy cleaning the house and helping the kids move their stuff into the room upstairs right above us. And then we're going to get Uncle Jen and Auntie Jen, Uncle Uncle Justin and Auntie Jen's room ready for them. Uncle Ty is going to be staying in there for now. So the kids have a lot of chores they need to do today. We had a little drama last night with them because they didn't do it yesterday, so they have all day today to do it. That's all they're going to do today. It's kind of their punishment because they didn't do it, do it yesterday. Okay, we're going to be heading out soon. I'll talk to you guys later. Someone asked me to talk about communications because I'm the one that didn't communicate to her. <laughs> <coughs> she was hey. I'm doing text. <laughs> no. Um, communication. The act, you know, that's the key word today. Whenever you hear the word communicate, communication, we're going to give a mm hmm. Communication is practice. Ready? Communication. Mm hmm. You got to have attitude. Some folks have attitude. Communication. Mm -hmm. There you go, I hear it. Mm -hmm. Communication. Mm -hmm. We So we gotta fill it in. Uh, bingo, first one to get in a row. Bingo! Who goes to the movies once a month? Where's your name? Who? My husband plays golf! I'm just saying! Bingo! Do you do your own I knew Lies! Hey, I used to live in Canada. I got one. I used to live in Canada. Do you like poetry? I put you down though. Oh, did you? Likes poetry. Sure. <laughs> oh, Kevin won the blackout. Ruby. Ruby? You didn't have to do it. Oh, I believe Lenti won the bingo and sister. <laughs> two times, won the blackout. Well, the importance of um, that's just communication. That's an everyday life. It's a. Uh, we're gonna go next door and make trouble to these guys for coming in and interrupting us. Here we go.
All right, you guys, I had a KT uh, appointment earlier today. I'm really excited to go back and meet up with them. Um, but anyways, yeah, it was a really good day today. I had awesome training, as you guys saw. And um, yeah, but we're going to call it a night. And it's super late right now. It's like past midnight, probably. Uh, but we've just been up taking care of the house, tidying up because we could say I didn't do nothing while we were gone all day today. And so we had to do it all when we came back. Right, Pika? Right, exactly. So, no, no, you didn't, you didn't do anything. Okay, uh, but anyways, yeah, that's what, that's what it is. Uh, watched this very inspirational video earlier today talking about, uh, it was on Facebook, I found it on Facebook and I shared it on Facebook, but it's awesome. So you guys gotta check it out. If you guys don't have us on Facebook, I'll be your friend, friend us. Check us out on Instagram. I don't really go on Twitter much, but I should just cause I'm young and hip and I'm so cool. And uh, yeah, <laughs> but anyways, uh, yeah, the video, it was awesome. It was talking about how uh, when most people come across wealth, it's it's uh, intergenerational health, a uh, wealth, meaning that it's wealth passed down from one generation to the next. Uh, but sorry, I'm so shaky. people. But if you if nothing was passed down to you, how do you? Well, and everything, the way that you spend your money. Okay, everything that you spend and everything that uh, that we spend is not just from us, but it's from uh, our our parents and our, our grandparents that have passed it down to us. Okay, and so, but if we didn't receive anything in the first place, then what is it that we're spending? You know, and who was that supposed to go to? Because most people, wealthy people, think about their future they think about the next generation and so they plan they prepare and they're strategic when it comes to building wealth for the next generation so that way they have something to leave for their next generation and so on and so forth but it has to start somewhere and so for example for me I had, I had never had anything handed down to me there's no wealth, no nothing handed down to me. Um, and so I definitely want to be able to do that for my kids. I want to leave a legacy behind for my kids that they can continue to add to and they can continue to build so that way they have something to leave for their kids. And so just want to encourage everybody to think about that. You know, think about that, you know, ge uh, intergenerational wealth. Um, you know, it's rare that somebody will be become wealthy in their lifetime uh, you know it, it's rare that that will happen but if you can build something and leave it behind for generations then you're setting your family up for a great future and so that's my and Cammy's goals with our business and with with you know with us financially that's that's our goal is to be able to do that so that way generations down the line they never ever have to worry about money it's never a question and so but anyways yeah hopefully you learned something from that if not check it out on facebook i posted it check it out it's pretty freaking awesome but yeah anyways love you guys it's late tomorrow's valentine's day and so we gotta wake up early and we gotta make a breakfast for mommy and it's gonna be yummy I got a lot of food so to make for tomorrow, so it'll be good. Uh, but yeah, anyways, love you guys. Thank you for watching. Continue to like, share, subscribe, blah, 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 all that stuff. Good stuff. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, bye. Good night. Pika, substitute. Use your hand. <laughs>
fill my heart with joy. 